So this is a phase 2B trial with an investigational agent called Evobrutini in patients with relapsing MS. In this trial we compared Evobrutini against placebo and we had a reference arm which was Tecfidera. And our goal was to show that the drug was able to reduce T1 GAD enhancing lesions and this is exactly what it showed. The study met the primary endpoint of reducing T1 gut lesions up to 24 weeks. I think they are going to be very excited because this is an oral treatment and it's the first in class to show that it works in MS. Um, and this kind of drugs, this class of drugs, is being investigated in several autoimmune diseases. So MS being an autoimmune disease, this is the first demonstration that this class of drugs actually works in autoimmune diseases. So it's very exciting. It has a mechanism of action that targets macrophages and also B cells, which have been implicated in MS pathogenesis. Uh, to me, on, in the good side of it, uh, we were very surprised at the magnitude of the decrease in the relapse rate. Uh, for an early study, for a phase two study with a limited number of patients, we were not expecting to see such a, a, a drastic reduction in relapses, uh, accompanied of course by the reduction in T1 gut lesions and other measures of disease activity in MS. That's on the efficacy side. On the safety side, uh, we saw an increase the um, LFTs in the patients on the higher dose, but these LFT elevations were all reversible and asymptomatic.